Hey lovelies, so I know I haven't been on here in quite a while, but today I'm going to talk to you guys about Orange is the New Black, and yep, I finished the season already, so if you're curious, keep watching my review on it, and if you haven't watched it yet, I would not watch this video, come back later, because there will be spoilers. First of all, I'm completely pissed off, okay? So, the season started with, um... <laughs> Oh my god, I can't even remember her name. Piper. Piper. Her name's Piper. With Piper, like, being, like, wanting to be, like, the leader of everything and just trying to be a dictator and all kinds of crazy. And then you had, like, the the Mexican people and the black people and all that people and the white people and um, the other chick. I can't remember her name, but she was, like, supposedly, like, the other group. I don't remember what it was. She was, like, speaking for the others that weren't in any of those categories. And, um, <clears throat> and they were all trying to team up together to take down this other, take down the guards and stuff. And that was later on in the season. But in the beginning, everyone hated Piper. And I'm just... Uh, I was so disappointed in her. Because, like, why? Why? Why is she being such a bitch? Like, why? She was being completely horrible. And, like, pretending like she's, like, the queen of the world. And it just made me so sad. And I'm still really mad. Like, I know this has nothing to do with... This video is going to be rambly, so I'm sorry. I'm still really, really pissed off that Daya's guard boyfriend totally ditched her and ditched the baby. Like, what the fuck, dude? He seemed like such a nice guy, and he totally just ditched her and was like, bye, bitch. Like, who does that? Who does that? And I just want to talk about the finale real quick because... And then I'm going to get back into other things because I just... My mind's focused on that. I'm like really, really sad, you know? I'm really sad because I had a really like connection with all the, I have a really a deep connection when I watch stuff. And so I was really feeling like all the characters and I really, really loved her, you know? She seemed, she was so sweet and she never was rude to anyone. She always wanted to help people and she was just such a nice person and it's so sad that they killed her off, you know? And I know it's just a TV show and people are going to be like, you're silly for like crying and I literally had like buckets of tears when I watched it. And girl, you need a box of tissues when you watch that episode because it's just so sad. And I feel bad for the guard because it's not like he was doing it on purpose. He was, he's such a nice guy, you know. He honestly didn't even realize he was doing it. And I'm just mad because why didn't anyone yell at him like, hey, get off your her, you're hurting her. And then he would have realized it and he would have got off of her, you know. He didn't realize that he was crushing her. And it's just, and I feel bad for crazy eyes, you know, because like... <sighs> Maybe one day she'll become normal. I know that sounds bad. Maybe one day she'll become normal and she'll realize that she killed one of her friends, you know? And it's just, she didn't kill her, but, you know, she aided in it because if she wasn't attacking that guy, he wouldn't have, like, stepped on her, you know, for so long. And it's just so sad. And, like, and then the ending, like, I really hope Daya doesn't shoot anyone because she's just gonna mess up her whole entire future, you know? And... If she does that, she's never going to get out. And then she's never going to see her baby. And then her mom saw the news, you know. And saw that the, the young teenager died or whatever. The young person died. She probably thought it was her, thought it was Daya. She's probably going to do something stupid to get back in there. And try to go back to jail so she can see her daughter again. And it's just so depressing, you know. And I just... I'm so mad, you know, and I just want to, I want to know, like, why did they kill her off? Usually, like, there's some reason, like, she didn't want to be in the show anymore, or, like, it just, it doesn't make sense to cut off a main character like that, and it's just so depressing, like, and I'm so mad at Caputo, I'm so mad at Caputo. He was getting, becoming such an asshole, like, such a big, huge butt, you know? He really was, and then at the very last episode, he finally started being nice again and wanting to help the and wanting to help the um the people, you know. And I just, oh my God, that girl he's dating, she's such a freaking horrible person. Oh, I hate her. 
Oh my god, and Tasty. I feel so bad for her. She looks so sad. You know, she lost her best friend. That's her best friend. Just died, and she had to watch her die, and it's just so depressing. And like, oh my god, all of the guards are so evil. Like, trying to get people to fight each other, and just, like, it makes you think, you know, like, is this what happens? Like, I mean, I know it's probably really horrible, and like, God, these flies or whatever they are won't leave me alone. I know it's horrible in prisons, but I wonder if it's, like, this horrible or if it's worse. Because that's just scary. Like, I know they're in there for a reason, but it's just, like, really scary to have to go to a prison and be treated like this. Like, you don't matter, you know? It's just... Oh, my God. Like, I know there's so much more I could talk about, but right now all I can think about is... Miss Busey, you know, I just freaking, I don't want her to die. Like, why did she have to die? Like, can she just come back as a ghost? Can she just be a ghost? Like, please. Just bring her back as a ghost. Someone. She could be, they could bring her twin in. They could bring her twin in. And then we could still see her. And, I don't know, just do something. Ah, oh, and the flashbacks of her before she went to jail just made me so sad because she's so pretty. And she was pretty before, but now she's even extra pretty. She has like a little jacket on and it just makes me sad. And I was sitting there crying. Like, it's kind of like the notebook. Like, I could watch it a million times and I'd still be crying buckets of tears. I just, oh. My life is over. My life is over. I just, I can't, I can't deal. Someone, someone save me. Someone save me. I'm wrecked and I just don't know anymore. I really, really just don't know.